In today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to navigate the TikTok Business Center to deactivate your account. This step-by-step -step process ensures that you can manage your business accounts effectively and efficiently. First, you'll wanna log into your TikTok Business Center. Accessing the Business Center is straightforward. Simply navigate to the platform using your web browser. Once you're there, you'll enter your credentials to log in. Remember the importance of keeping your login information secure to protect your account. Once logged in, you'll need to access the verification settings. Look to the left hand side of your screen where you'll find a menu. Click on verification. This section provides various options that are pivotal in managing and ultimately deactivating your account. Next, it's time to initiate the deactivation process. In the verification section, you'll notice an option labeled deactivate account. Go ahead and click on that. Initiating this process is the first essential step towards deactivating your business center account. But remember, there are specific prerequisites you must fulfill before you can proceed. Let's walk through those requirements. Firstly, make sure you close all ad accounts owned by the business center. This means going through each account carefully to ensure nothing is left running. Then unlink all ad accounts that are not owned by the business center. This step is crucial as linked accounts may prevent successful deactivation. You also need to unlink any associated TikTok shops, creator marketplace accounts, one accounts, business accounts, as well as any parent or child business centers. This might seem like a long list, but think of it as a thorough cleanup of associated platforms to avoid any complications. Furthermore, remove all associated partners from your account, which includes checking any active partnerships or collaborations. Lastly, verify that there are no pending members within your business center. Members with pending statuses can inadvertently stall the deactivation process. Once you've confirmed that all these requirements are met, you can confidently click Next. This will lead you to review refund information. Check both the available balance in your business center account and the expected refund amount. The clarity here ensures you manage your finances effectively. Once you're satisfied, click Confirm. Now, your business center account will be marked as pending deactivation for seven days. This period allows you to reconsider if needed. During this time, you can choose to cancel the deactivation request by clicking Stop Account Deactivation. However, if everything is in order and no further action is taken, your account will automatically deactivate after the seven day period. And that's it. You've now learned how to safely deactivate your TikTok Business Center account, ensuring that all necessary steps are completed to maintain account integrity. Thank you for following along and I hope this guide has been helpful.